Currently tonight, Minter Field Air Museum has survived 82 years of baking in the Kern County heat. Needless to say, it was looking a little worse for the wear. Yes, but Ronald Pierce, board chair of the Air Museum, said a gentleman contacted him after reading an article on Minter Field and said that he wanted to help. During the conversation, the bid of $40,000 to repaint the museum came up. And the gentleman representing the Johnson Family Fund told Pierce that they would take care of the whole $40,000. Visitors to Minterfield Air Museum might not recognize the old base. The buildings shine with a brand new sparkling white coat of paint administered by Steve Holloway and his crew. They did so much work. I am glad that they did it because it, it, it came clear down to bare wood and started all over. The wood, the paint is not going to peel on this one. Oh, it looks so good. Pierce mm -hmm. says Minter Field, of course, was once the largest basic training field for the Army Air Corps on the West Coast and started graduating pilots before Pearl Harbor, sending more than 11,000 cadets to fly in World War II. On November 4th, Minter Field will host Wings and Wheels Car and Plane Show. For more information, you can visit MinterfieldAirMuseum.com.